lot of people worship their games. But who do the characters in those games worship? And if you think too long, we know you're not ready. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we'll be ranking our picks for the top 10 fictional religions in video games. Permission granted. For this list, we're only considering religions that were completely created within a video game and only one entry per franchise. Makes sense. Of course not. Number 10, The Daedric Princes, the Elder Scrolls series. I am the spirit of the hunt. Just one glimpse of the glorious stalker that your kind calls Hercene. A universe as big and deep as Elder Scrolls can't just settle for a single deity. Many people that live throughout the lands of Tamriel believe in the Daedric Princes, the most powerful of the Daedric entities, and worship them like gods. My glory shall protect you from all this world's grievances. It can be argued whether the Daedric Lords are good or evil, as they have a twisted sense of morality and exist on a plane completely above the mortal races. I am the guardian of the unseen and knower of the unknown. The Daedric Pantheon is somewhat similar to Greek and Roman pantheons, as each lord represents certain concepts or states of being, such as ambition, discord, or madness. What is this? It's, it's just a book. I can... Number 9. The Founders, Bioshock Infinite. Our prophet fills our lungs with water, so they may better love the air. The major political party in the city of Columbia, the Founders try to model their beliefs and ideals off those of the Founding Fathers of the United States. Just because the city flies don't mean it ain't got its fair share of fools. Through a kind of crazy hyper-Christianity, the Founders worship their leader, Zachary Comstock, like a demigod often referring to him as the prophet. I told you, Comstock, you sell them paradise and the customers expect cherubs for every chore. <laughs> the founders actually believe that the gifted Elizabeth will succeed her father when he passes away and will help them tear down the lower world to rebuild it in Columbia's image. We ain't letting no false shepherd into our flock. <laughs> Show them what we got planned, boys. <laughs> Number eight. Church of the Children of the Atom, Fallout 3. Welcome, welcome to Megaton. In a world that's essentially ended a hundred years ago, it's natural that some people would seek solace in religion. I, I guess you're right. Found in the first main city of Megaton, these people are led by the twisted confessor Cromwell. Please child, come to the church anytime, anytime at all. Sounds pretty straightforward, right? Well, here's the twist. They worship the giant, active but unexploded atomic bomb in the center of their town. He is coming with the clouds, and every eye shall be blind with his glory. Their beliefs are at least a little bit thought-provoking, as they believe that inside each atomic bomb lies a new universe. That means that they see the great war that ended civilization as we know it to be a monumentally holy event, and one worth celebrating. Come forth and drink the waters of the glow. For this ancient weapon of war is our salvation. Number seven, The Order, Silent Hill series. It's time for mankind to be released from the shackles of sin which bind them. Most of these religions are pretty grim, but you knew that there was going to be at least one straight up doomsday cult on this list. The time has come. You can kill her now. Inhabiting the city of Silent Hill in Maine, the Order is a doomsday cult that believes in an incarnation of God that will destroy the world when she is reborn. You will birth a god and build an eternal paradise. The Order justifies its actions as they don't believe in good or evil, only chaos and order. Yes, and that's why we need God. While The Order originated in the Silent Hill series, its ideals are a mishmash of Christianity, Aztec rituals, Native American beliefs, and Japanese folklore. Now, Alessa, there's nowhere else to run. Number six, Los Illuminados, Resident Evil 4. My name is Osman Sadler, the master of this fine religious community. Resident Evil takes religion head on. The main antagonist in the fourth game, Los Illuminados is a cult that sprung up in rural Spain. Los Illuminados? That's a mouthful. Members of Los Illuminados are responsible for capturing the US president's daughter so that they could infect her with the parasitic Las Plagas. 
Las Plagas, while seemingly disgusting to you and me, holds spiritual significance to Los Illuminados, who believe it as the key to their salvation. I wouldn't want my special guests on the island feeling unattended. As such, in order to fully believe, you have to accept the parasite through mind and body. Don't you think this is a revolutionary way to promulgate one's faith? Number five, the Brotherhood of Nod, Command and Conquer series. Cain lives! Behind every successful religion is a successful leader, and nobody symbolizes this better than the Brotherhood of Nod and their enigmatic leader, Cain. I have always believed that faith was measured in deeds, not words. A militaristic organization that can trace its existence back to 1800 BC. Nod came to prominence in 1995, after the discovery of Tiberium. The time has come to destroy GDI! Members of the Brotherhood see Cain as an immortal prophet who will lead Nod to the next stage of human evolution, with Tiberium being their catalyst. The Brotherhood remains stronger than ever. Our commitment to Tiberium undying. Religion and evolution? Doesn't sound right, but they are the bad guys after all. And with your help, we will continue to spread the gospel. Number four, Teachings of Yevon, Final Fantasy X. Life is but a passing dream, but the death that follows is eternal. Never has a single religion been so powerful in a single world. The main religion of almost everyone in Spira, the religion is named after Yu Yevon, who was a summoner a thousand years prior to the events of the game. Indeed, that is the essence of heaven. The teachings prohibit the use of any form of mechanical technology, referred to as machina, as it said that their usage could lead to the birth of the giant monster Sin, who has ravaged the world of Spira for centuries. Aren't those weapons forbidden by Yevon? There are exceptions. This is, of course, a false teaching used to keep humanity from gaining the ability to defeat Sin, who Yu Yevon himself has actually now become. It is a cycle of death, spiraling endlessly. Number three, the Covenant, Halo series. We swore to uphold the Covenant, even through our dying breath. Seen more as a military brigade, most people wouldn't believe that there's actually a method to this madness. The Council decided to have you hung by your entrails and your corpse paraded through the city. As the different races that make up the Covenant forces are bound by a unifying belief. They all believe in the Forerunners, a superior race that hasn't existed in thousands of years. The Forerunners were a wise, highly intelligent, noble people. And with a belief in justice, in peace, they bravely faced the adversary. They accepted that the Forerunners discovered a way to transcend past the physical world and become divine via the construction of the Halos. An array of weapons scattered throughout the galaxy. This does turn out to be a huge misunderstanding as the Halos are actually designed to wipe out all life in order to contain the Flood. But that's where you come in, Chief. You look nice. Thank you. Number two, Unitology, Dead Space series. Have you ever felt like you were meant to be part of something bigger? Then maybe Unitology is for you. You'd think that aliens and religion would be mutually exclusive, but not in this case. Is your soul prepared to feed them? Or will you be judged unworthy and cast aside? The Unitologists, who are technically the primary antagonists of the Dead Space series, are based off the ideas of the first man to discover proof of aliens, Michael Altman. Believers understand that humanity was created by the intelligent design of a superior alien race, the secrets of which are hidden in the sacred artifacts known as markers. Well, that's why we brought you here. To build markers for us. If you want to learn more information about Unitology, you will have to join as the inner workings are for members only. Chances of horrible space zombification are unfortunately quite high if you join. Before we reveal our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. We have your email address. We will send you an incredible education tool that will help you to unlock the secrets of the existence. That will cost as little as $5,000. Oh. In the beginning, all was darkness. That was how the first ones preferred it, for they were so hideous that even they could not bear to look upon themselves. Incredible. Oh, it is Himiko. But look, the bowl, the candles. Why is she still being worshipped? This island, it must have once been part of Yamatai. You were right, Laura. <sighs> Number one, the Chantry of Andraste, Dragon Age series. And the path 
The dominant religion in the Dragon Age universe, the Chantry of Andraste, believe in a god named the Maker, who appropriately created the world and all of life. As the legend goes, the Maker spoke to a mortal woman named Andraste, who spread his teachings while leading the oppressed people of Ferelden in a war for freedom against the Tevinter Imperium. Because they fear, not just Corypheus, but Tevinter, rightful ruler of every piece of ground you trod in your pathetic life. In the end, Andraste was burned at the stake when the Ferelden leaders, including her husband, turned her over to the Tevinters in exchange for a country of their own. Very wise. For this terrible sin, the Maker turned his back on the mortal world, forsaking the people and ignoring their prayers until humanity proved itself worthy. Somehow. Maker's breath. Maker have mercy. Do you agree with our list? I don't know. Mm, I just don't get it. What's your favorite fictional video game religion? For more philosophical top tens published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. It took me almost two hours to process and understand all that information.